Michael here with Lawrence, big Lawrence, relative unknown. Tell everybody how you got uh, into the sport and how it is you've become so, uh, not famous, but so well known so quickly. Um, well, basically, I started throwing properly last year. I got a new coach and I uh, took distance on properly last year, and um, I improved massively. And I, I did well at the junior on the junior level, and uh, I decided to take two years out um, of studying. Uh, I deferred my place at uni to um, train full time for two years, and um, yeah, this year has been crazy. You know, I've done really well, and um, it's, it was a two-year plan, and the plan is to peak next year. So, as much as I've achieved next year, it's, um, this year, I'm really looking forward to next year and you know doing well at the stadium behind us in the Olympics. You say that uh, you're at uni. What were you studying and, and what did you hope to be other than an athlete? No, um, I was at school and I I um, I, defer, I, I applied to university. Taking a year out. Yeah, two years out. What did you want to do? I'm, I'm going to Oxford to do law. So, uh, I've got my place there. And, it's all, I've concentrated and solely on throwing and, and um, being the best I can be in discus and it's paying dividends obviously I'm doing well but it's a long way to go for me in school before I can call myself the best so which is what my goal is. You've already set records, tell me about some of those. Yeah I've uh, set a British record um, in July and I've got the you know um, world age best so no 19 year old thrown further than I have. In the world's history, in the world's history. That must make you feel good. Yeah, obviously, you know, definitely. But um, I have, you know, big ambitions, and I and I, I hope to do well, and hope to do things, you know, young, and do things, do well young. So it's going to be a tough journey. It's a, there's a lot of hard work ahead, so it's go, it's going to be tough. But you know, that's that's what being an athlete is all about. Have you studied this? What do you know? The history of the discus. Yeah, I could, I could, if you ask me any questions. Go for it, go for it. Tell me, <laughs> tell me who inspires you of the history, maybe the most recent history. Um, well, I think um, five-time world champion Lars Riedel. I don't know. Um, he's a, he's, a, he's a, you know, he's, he's a big man, really. yeah, he's a, he's a big guy and he's he's done wonders and I, I've watched a lot of him on YouTube and I've, I studied his technique and there are a lot of you know other other discus throws that I've studied, but because it because you, it is you do have to learn the event and you have to spend the time you know looking at it to, if you want to do well. So I've looked at a lot of people like him and uh, world record holder Jürgen Schult and um, current world champion Robert Harting I've looked at and um, hopefully I'm, I'm just looking to hopefully be caught and be named in the same esteem as these guys, you know, because they've done, you know, incredibly well and um, uh, hopefully I'll do well as well. Thanks for time. Good luck, yeah? No worries. Thanks, mate.